So we have a recruit, class 127. We're doing hose streams and appliances this week. It's our final day. So today we're doing extended stretches, either a long distance on the ground or a long distance going up, such as like a, a three or four story apartment building. We are also flowing lines up and down stairs and moving two and a half and inch three quarter into our burn cans. I know I'm partial in the hose class. Every fire we go to, we may not ventilate. We may not search right off the bat. We may not force doors, but we're always gonna put a line on the ground and flow water, no matter what it is. This is the basis for everything they're gonna do when they get on the street and they go to a fire. This is prepping them for the most important job they're gonna have, and that's going to a fire in the city. So more people are saved by well-placed hose line than anything else. So if they get this right and are proficient at it throughout their career, they're gonna save lives and property every day. So this is our fifth day, it's our final day. Such a huge change from day one until now. They're a hustling group, they do great. They're fast learners. They've done awesome in all the hose work. I think they'll be prepared for when they get out, but the thing is, is, is we have to train every day. You know, these are skills that they have to practice with repeatedly throughout the next 25, 30 years to maintain what they're gonna do on a fire. It's not just this week that matters, it's the rest of their career. So I've always been assigned to an engine. I love engine work. I started helping with hose class back at class 73 and we're at 127 now. It's my favorite class. You get to do so much during it. You get to see the progress of the recruits. Everybody loves it. It's hard work. As long as you like working, this is a class for you. And everybody that teaches with us loves the work. Pull up at the spot and you know I'm steady blazing.